forest. Have you ever thrown your trick or treat sack on your back on All Hallows Eve and taking your leave of town? Beyond houses with welcoming doors, beyond schools and churches and stores, beyond the zoo with the lion that roars, what do you think you will find? I'll give you a hint. It's not gravestones. It's not a ghost that moans and groans. You'll find a forest of bones. <laughs> The bare bones of trees stand on a hill in the chill breeze. And hanging from the branches are bat bones. Climbing the trunks are cat bones. Starling in the roots are rat bones. Bat bones, cat bones, rat bones, and all are looking at you. There are dog bones digging up hog bones and frog bones jumping over log bones. There are even fog bones. And together they cry, take care, beware, despair. You can bet you've just met your worst nightmare. And you, will you sigh? Will you cry? Will you dash away in utter dismay? No, because you're too tough to worry about stuff like the rattle and prattle of bones. You'll just say, boo! Or poo, or even wahoo. <laughs> While you wiggle and wriggle and squiggle your bones, then you take your sack off your back and hold it with a shout. Trick or treat! Smell my feet! Give me some bingo to eat! And what else can the boom forest do but give all its candy to you? The end. Thread by thread, stitching it together.